And what you're seeing now is, is clash detection being run. And, and so just by selecting the um, components that you'd like to run clash against, uh, entering a tolerance, and naming this clash, you know, again, it's all date and time stamped, um, including the results of that clash and, uh, and stored in the system. Now you can see there um, infinite computing power of the cloud instantly uh, analyzed all of the structural members with the ductwork, and, uh, and all the clashes have been identified. You can see there's a very Navisworks type um, environment here in which to navigate with gravity, uh, with your little avatar uh, figure, as well as a two dimensional um, map that shows you where the clashes are located. And, um, and so what the system allows you to do is, is, to, is to automatically group and, and again, this is one of the things that I hear a lot from our customers is, you know, this tool is very powerful in that it automatically creates groupings for you. So while in a, using Navisworks, which, which is, of course, a desktop solution, you would have to group these things together manually um, before notifying, in this case, probably the MEP contractor of a duck that needs to be lowered. And, and so you can, uh, you can, add any comments that again are all recorded in the system so so for the first time you have you have a central location with a list of chron chronologically of all activities that have occurred on this project and so you can see here there's a hierarchy uh, up for this clash where that top level contains all of the all of the small all of the individual clashes in that grouping and this um, high level grouping of, of issues can now easily be sent in this case to to Ed here who is our mechanical contractor um, who will uh, get a one-click link to this location to this um, clash in uh, in the BIM 360 glue uh, but it also allows him to synchronize his Revit model or his AutoCAD MEP model uh, with this clash report to uh, to ensure that or to, to very easily um, identify this, this piece of duct that needs to be lowered. And so not only can you glue directly from the authoring tools, but you can synchronize um, your clash reports with those authoring tools as well.